What's good, YouTube? This your man, Spill Dog. Boy, 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 old Frank got, man, he got blasted up out of here. Uh, but you know what? He ain't got nothing to be ashamed of. I think he fought a good fight. He just fought a better fighter and a, and a harder puncher. I felt like Frank won the first three rounds. He was doing good at that point. But I think once Frank, well, you know, Tank was always coming forward, but at first he was just mental pressure. Once he started shooting them jabs and them big left hands, uh, it, it seemed like Frank was getting more and more timid, if you ask me, as the rounds went on. And Tank had started landing some big shots in the fourth and fifth round here and there, and it just seemed like it took a lot of the, the confidence, in my opinion, away from uh, Frank. It didn't like he was – uh, he got comfortable to me, like he got uncomfortable in the ring and kept, he was running so much that he ended up on the ropes and in the corner a lot. And Derrick James was telling him to stay off the ropes, but in order for him to stay off the ropes, he would have had to been fighting more. And once Tank started letting his hands go, uh, Frank stopped letting his go. You know, he, it just like, seemed like he just got major gun shot and just kept moving back, moving back, moving back, you know, and looking for the perfect counter punch and tank got too much too much experience to just lay there and let you play him like that you know uh i feel like the experience had a lot to do with what happened in the fight tonight i feel like uh tank really you know i didn't see i didn't see uh frank in the back room warming up you know before the fight and i kept saying it on my live thing you know I would like to see him get warm in the dress room and get a good lather going before he get in the ring. Maybe he did. I didn't see it, you know. And uh, you know, I I just ain't never seen no nothing good from a fighter that's not getting you know get get a good sweat going before they go in the ring. And uh, you know, I don't know if they had the right game plan or not. I just know it didn't turn out right, you know. Uh, and I say this, uh, you know, f you know, Frank. Did he 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 did good, you know. He he did good for as long as it lasted. Uh, but tank tank do everybody like this, so this ain't really a, nothing for him to be ashamed of, you know. This is what tank do not do's out, and I would say, I would say this is gonna help him a lot as he go forward in his development, cause he, he I'm sure he gained a lot of experience in this fight. And he got a lot of uh, exposure. It's going to be a lot more people who know who Frank Martin is, not just from him being in this fight. Uh, you win some, you lose some. It ain't nothing to be ashamed of. You lost to a better a better fighter. And, and you know, for the most part, people knew that before you got in there. Uh, 18 fights, I felt like that wasn't enough fights for him to have to be in there with a guy with, the, with Tank's experience. But, I do I do respect uh, Earl for letting his fighter go and fight if he feel like he's ready for a big fight, letting him have it, you know, uh, you know, and, and that's what you want a guy that, that's promoting you to do, believe in you, even even if it's to a fault. You know, uh, you know, I don't wanna be fighting for nobody that don't believe in what I'm trying to do and what I can and can't do. So I like to fight. I, I, you know, it was the best fight of the night, which it should have been. It was the main event, and and Tank closed the show like a, a true champion. Uh, I think, I think if you ask me who was next, I would think it would be Shakur Stevenson. I could be wrong, but I think that's probably who Tank gonna get will be trying to fight next. If anybody uh see how Shakur look next month when he fight at home, but uh, hey man, you gotta give you, you gotta give Tank all the respect and credit in the world for closing the show like a real champion and uh you gotta give frank respect for being being willing to get in the ring with this 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 few what it with his fewer fights that he had and thinking he could beat or i'm uh, thinking he could beat uh javante davis uh but i guarantee you if he didn't respect tank before the fight he respect him now and he respect that power too he see that power for real you know, Tank is this shit is this, this power is not Fugazi. Tank is the real deal, man, and uh, I think he's gonna keep on proving it. I don't think none of these dudes at the weight class can take them punches, and if he can put if he get a good shot on you, it's gonna change everything. So it don't matter who it is. I think at one thirty five, Tank is the guy. You know, until somebody go in there and beat him, I'm gonna have to say Tank is the guy. But uh, that's it for me on this video. If you like the video, hit the like and subscribe. Till next time, it's your boy Spill Dog. I'm out.